Hi guys, I'm in the dark room again. This time we've got the lights on because we're going to create some chemigrams and we do not need to have the red lights on when we're doing it. Plus we're going to be using some very strange resists to kind of stop the lights affecting the paper. Here's an array of things that I've got for chemigrams. You can use just about any kind of resist on there. So we've got some toothpaste, we've got some butter, we've got some honey, we've got some spray, PVA glue, um, beard balm, clearly not mine, must be Adam's. We've got some tape in here as well and some other bits and pieces. We've got lots of paintbrushes and we've got lots of different types of spatulas so that you can apply your resist onto the paper. I've done it again when I've forgotten to bring my tripod. I'm going to try to place this somewhere so you can see me applying the paper. Make sure that you are using the tray, you've got a tongue, and also one of the most important things is you are not going to put them through these trays. That is really, really important because I do not want lots and lots of butter, oils in these trays because it's really hard to get off at a later point. So I've applied some different substances, a bit of butter, a bit of oil spray, toothpaste, um, applied them with kind of spray, that's with the spatula, I've used my finger, I've used a bit of cotton wool, but as you can see, the light's starting to get to it, which means that they're already starting to change some very interesting colours. Now what you can do now is you can either get your paintbrush and you could paint on some areas where you want it to develop. Now if you paint it on with the developer first of all, and it's going to go, a re it's just going to instantly go black. That can look quite interesting. However, if you want things to go white, then you use the fixer. Got paintbrush again, dipping it in the fixer. Sometimes as well if you make it, so then we can keep it white. I'm just going to flip it on. You can start seeing straight away that it starts going white and obviously where the resist is on, it's resisting the fixer. You can also spray it as well. Um, you can pour it on and drip it through. You know, you can even mix developer and fix together. Itself together. You can see, I'm so sorry I didn't bring my tripod again and you can start seeing that you get some really interesting sort of color patterns as well where it's trying to come through the actual paper so i'm going to carry on i need a free hand to do this i'm going to go and get some spray and we'll see what happens so here you can see that i have finished my different solutions um, i've still got quite a lot of bits of resist bit of toothpaste there, a little bit of margarine on there, other bits and pieces. So ideally what I need to do now is I need to wash this. You want to make sure you use warm water and use the fairy washing up liquid to give it a good, really good wipe. And then please do not use the dryer, please use the drying rack. Thank you.